Hey guys, I see you back with another video. Today I'm going to be showcasing Ember, which is the best Roblox script executor uh, as of now. It has 96% unk and 94% sunk. And for what they lose in, you know, sunk and unk, they actually gain in stability. It's, it's basically one of the most stable script executors to use right now. And that ratio for, you know, unk and, you know, sunk and stuff all the way to uh, stability, it's perfectly fine, so... Let's just get into the video. I'm gonna be showcasing how to uh, actually download it and you know use it and stuff, you know, and set it up. And we'll actually run the uh, we'll actually run the unk and sunk test. So let's go. So first thing uh, I'm gonna do is here on the uh, the Discord. I'm just gonna go to. All right. So first thing I'm gonna do is I'll leave the Ember Discord in the uh, description. But you guys wanna go to the Ember Discord here? Uh, you guys can go to download, and then you guys will have this here. Uh, I'll just turn that off. So here you guys can either go to the bootstrapper here, which is just going to download the uh, zip file for Ember, <clears throat> or you guys can go and download the zip directly. So I'm going to actually download the zip directly, so I'm just going to click here. And it should download it up here. And then uh, for um, Google, if you guys are using Chrome, you guys are going to see this. You guys just want to click this, and it's going to ask, like, keep download. So you guys want to click allow download. It is detected as a... Uh, like virus or it thinks it's a virus because uh it has uh, obfuscation and obviously the injector so obviously though it's not it's very trusted and uh, yeah so first thing i want to do is right here since this is a zip file you guys can just right click it extract all and then extract and uh i'll wait for it to extract <clears throat> all right it's finally done uh, extracting and here we have ember 2 and i'm just gonna drag it to my desktop and then i'm done with that and close it so now that I'm here, uh, first thing I'm going to do is actually create an exclusion for this in uh, our virus and threat protection so it doesn't keep getting deleted and uh, falsely falsely deleted. So we're just going to go here, manage settings, add or remove exclusions, <clears throat> then you can click add exclusion, folder, and then we're going to navigate to a desktop which is where I put it, and I'm just going to select this, and then click select folder. And then I can close that for now and uh, we should be good. So what you guys want to do is actually open up the Ember folder and you're just going to see some stuff here. You guys can see run certification.exe. So what we actually need to do is when you guys are like injecting Ember and stuff, we need to inject signed code. So Roblox can obviously, you know, think that we are, you know, actually injecting good code, even though it's uh, all the script hubs you guys are injecting for your auto farm and stuff. And it's just the injection. So we obviously to do that, we need a certification which uh, Ember has right here, which we need to install. So we just right click it, run as admin, more info, run anyway. Yes. And then uh, yeah, you guys just go through the setup. It's gonna load in a second. Right here. You just click okay. And then click uh, accept the agreement. Next, next, next. And then install, should install pretty quickly. And it's just, uh, it's not even that much info or uh, stuff that needs to be installed. And you just click finish. Now, uh, this does, you guys do have to do this so the uh, certification can actually be, uh, you know, reloaded and stuff. Click your Windows button, click the power button, and uh, sadly you have to restart. So I'll be back with you guys once I'm uh, restarted. Alright, uh, now that I restarted my computer, I'm not restarted, but now that I've re restarted my computer, uh, I can open up Roblox. And uh, once I'm here, I can just open up the Ember folder. And we can open Ember.exe. So it's going to say this, just click more info, run anyway. And this is going to open up. It's going to say make sure you guys uh, actually ran certification.exe or you guys won't be able to inject. Obviously we did that right now in the previous step, so we just click I understand. And once we're here, we're going to have this. So it's going to just say, you know, this is the uh, Ember right here. So we have a basically script hub function here. We can search up like the hood. And we're going to get the hood stuff, you know. We can search up even like, you know, just really anything like unk. Yeah, and we're going to get stuff related to that right here, like environment test. So... I could type in the whole thing. I'm a bit lazy for that, but yeah, we have like Unk Checker, like the GUI version of it. So yeah, that's the script hub they have. Um, oops, where'd it go? And they have a home page, but that's obviously being worked on right now. Apuzid is a fairly new executor, but obviously it's it's honestly it's it's a great executor. And then we have some features here. We have the internal interface, you know, not, not, so you don't have to actually use this EXE right here. We have topmost. So let's say I put this on a second monitor, and I can just play the game like this. Uh, but if I'm here, like, I, I can't. And then we have uh, init script, which just resets uh, the environment, you know, because obviously when you do inject, it does run an initialization script, you know, so. Yeah, so, and they also have stuff like open file, save file, clear, 
but you can do it now. And they also have a beautiful tab system. And uh, yeah, so and then they have the inject. So real quick, we're just gonna go and click inject. And it is gonna ask for um oh look there. It is gonna ask for a uh, oops. It's gonna ask for a key right here. Also, we just enter our key. I have a key, and I'll actually give away a couple of keys in my Discord server. You know, so at the time, I think the giveaways will end in like three days. Uh, go to my Discord server, check out, and I'll uh, give it a couple of keys for like a week and stuff. So I can enter my key, click enter, and it will actually inject now. And then, uh, yeah, you guys will see loaded, and now I can just type in here like print i, and I'll do that. We can do a uh, print identity eight. And then we can uh, actually go grab some scripts we're gonna run right here. So let's try like the unk test. And we got 94. And then we can go grab the sunk test. Well, this is a uh, sunk is pretty laggy. So, you know, I mean, it's obviously testing multiple functions. You know, it's not that the script is bad, it's just it's a bit laggy. So we'll wait for it. Right, and we got 92 sunk and then you know we can obviously inject stuff like uh infinite yield and ember does actually have uh what's it called uh lua armor support so you guys don't keep getting those errors saying you know lua armor isn't supported and stuff ember has lua armor support so thankfully you guys can use all your like auto farms and stuff on those games you know i've gotten a couple of dms about that so yeah and yeah that's just a showcase of this uh showcase of ember it's an amazing uh executor the owners are amazing people too they actually reached out for me for the showcase so uh yeah that's ember hope you guys use it it's, you guys should actually use it. it's probably the best executor for uh, 2025 right now for this month basically and it probably will stay that way for like probably the rest of the year so i'll uh, i'll catch you guys in the next video but uh thank you for watching and uh, we'll see you guys next time